tonight Let's go to far off places And search for treasures bright Come dream with me tonight Let's build a giant airship And sail into the sky Let's watch the ground so far below Let's watch the birds as they fly by Fly so high Come dream with me tonight friend. Oh, 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 where? Where am I? We'll talk later. For now, sleep. They frightened the children terribly. I wish I'd been here. They said they were looking for Teddy. And they went to Gimmick's house and smashed it all up. Oh, I don't like this at all. I hope nothing's happened to our friends. Hmm. Do you think those Gatangs might have kidnapped Teddy, Grubby, and Gimmick? I don't know, Wooly. Oh, if only there were some way to be certain. Hey! Maybe the wizard could tell us where they are. He knows everything. Well, he's not usually very accurate, but I suppose we should try him, just in case. You will tell us where the crystals are hidden. Or else... Or else what? Uh, uh, indeed, a most uh, appropriate question. I am running out of patience. We will have those crystals one way or another. Not from us, you won't. Oh, I should warn you. The Supreme Oppressor is rather experienced at extracting information! But, uh, uh, oh, uh, we don't know where the crystals are, do we, Gimmick? Eh, uh, 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 no, eh, uh, we, we, we most definitely do not. And even if we did, we wouldn't tell you. So go ahead, be nasty. Uh, but not too nasty. I warn you, you shall pay for this stubbornness. Come, Maggot Heart. Oh, farewell for now. But we shall return. <laughs> and when we do, you'll be sorry! Hey, that Queller is a most unpleasant fellow. And that Maggot Heart lady is no prize either. He certainly is uh, determined to get those crystals. I wonder uh, why. Beats me, but Teddy would have done anything to keep them away from Feller. And that's good enough for me. Yes, Grubby. We owe it to Teddy's uh, memory to find the crystals and make sure they are only used for uh, good. And the first step is to loosen these ropes and uh, uh, escape. No, Queller. Oh? The crystals. Must save them. Mavo airship. The crystal belt. What 
What a lovely day. What's this? Aaron, come quickly. What is it, sister? Another Katang raid? No, it's good news. It looks like our friends have come to visit us. Hmm. It is Gimmick's airship, but it's flying in a most unusual manner. <gasps> oh, no! They're going to crash! <gasps> come, Aaron, we must hurry. Teddy, Grubby, Gimmick! I can't imagine what happened. Usually they fly this machine so skillfully. Are you all right, friends? I say, you chaps. Chaps? How peculiar. There's not a soul on board. What could have happened to them? We, we know, know everything. We were there. Who said that? Come out. Show yourselves, <gasps> cowards. We, we better not. You have that big sword. Most peculiar. Excuse me, you're sitting on my head. Huh? Sister, this barrel just talked. Is someone in there? Oh, oh stop, that tickles. Good heavens! I say! Please don't hurt us. We need your help. If we're going to save our friends, you must give us a chance to speak. But who are you? We're the Anythings. They seem harmless enough, Aaron. Maybe. But how do you come to be flying Gimmick's airship? Yes. And where are our friends, Teddy, Grubby, and Gimmick? Well, they're our friends, too. And something terrible has happened. That's why we're here. All right. Now calm down and tell us everything from the beginning. Well, we were born in the mushroom forest many years ago. Well, not that far back. Yeah. Start with the soup. Oh, right. Well, we were in this vegetable patch minding our own business when... And the last thing we saw was Teddy falling into the water. We couldn't help him. And now Teddy's gone. That is indeed a sad story. It grieves me to learn of the loss of such a true friend. But Grubby and Gimmick are still alive. And we've got to save them. We'll help you. Who knows what Queller and his mob of monsters might do? You're right, sister. There's not a moment to lose. Now, my brave friends, we'll help you repair the airship. While we work, we can devise a plan to rescue Gimmick and Grubby. Okay! Here, my friend. Tea. <coughs> slowly, slowly, this potion will help make you well. Who are you? A friend. Who are you? I'm... I'm... Teddy... Ruxpin. Teddy Ruxpin. The Wizard of Grando, he knows most everything. I don't know why, but his magic eye can see from here to the land of Ying. The Wizard of Grando. Hey! Oh, 
gee, I'm sorry. Why should you be sorry? It was only a door after all. This, on the other hand, was a priceless Ying vase. I'm sure Wooly didn't mean to damage your door or your vase. Heck no! We came to ask for your help! Well, thanks to you, we're closed for repairs. But Teddy Grubby and Gimmick are missing! Missing, you say? Is there a reward? If you help us find our friends, you'll be paid handsomely, wizard. In that case, come on in. What am I saying? You are in. Well, come this way. And please, don't touch anything. Now what? And how might I help you? You must help us find our friends. That might be expensive. Oh, we'll pay you gladly. So that's it. A couple of paying customers. <laughs> Perhaps the magic eye will tell us of their whereabouts. See, Miss Leona, I told you the wizard could help us. He knows all kinds of things. Perhaps, Wooly, but these little magic tricks are not very scientific. Science has nothing to do with it. We're talking wizardry. Now, if you'll be seated, we'll proceed. We're ready. All right. Everybody concentrate. Oh, great magic eye that knows all and sees all. Great and mystical magic eye. Help us to locate... Uh, what are their names again? Teddy, Grubby, and Gimmick. Of course. Tell us, where are Teddy, Grubby, and Gimmick? They're gonna love this. Grubby, Gimmick, look! Fast Who's fast Monsters and villains that got him! Well, so we meet again. Hand over the crystals. Move, you fuzzy barnacle! Move! Oh, no! Teddy, he's gone! <laughs> he was about the bestest friend a once it could ever have! He was a decent little fellow, wasn't he? Anyway, uh, at least we can still rescue Grubby and Garrick! Yes, that's right. I did help you find two of your friends, <laughs> so... Very well. Uh, I have heard of small change, but this is ridiculous. Just a moment, Wooly. <laughs> You also sell cotton candy? Yeah, I have to. Wizardry doesn't bring in a lot of profit. Nobody pays. Very well. I'll take, um, 127 cotton candies, please. 127? <laughs> Certainly. An unusual number. But who am I to argue with a customer? Put the cotton candy in a bag, please, Wooly. I'll pay the wizard. Brr, no more wood sprite coins, I hope? No, actually, these are elf coins. It's mighty nice of you to buy all this cotton candy, Miss Leona. I'm just crazy about sweet stuff. The cotton candy isn't for eating, Wooly. It's part of my plan. <laughs> Only the pure of spirit may find the treasure of knowledge, the treasure of knowledge. Hmm. We gotta get out of here somehow, Gimmick. Uh, precisely what I've been thinking, Grubby, but uh, uh, how? I don't know. 
I haven't felt much like thinking lately. Don't give up. Perhaps a calm, logical approach will furnish us with an idea. And now, let's see. These metal bars appear to be a, a particularly strong. And this door is, a, is quite sturdy. Hmm, stone walls, dirt uh, floors. Did you say dirt floors? Uh, why, yes, I did. That's our answer, Gimmick. We'll tunnel our way out. <laughs> Splendid idea, uh, uh, Grubby. If it works with mud blops, it might also work with uh, uh, monsters. Exactly my line of reasoning, too. How are we doing, Gimmick? Well, according to my uh, uh, calculations, uh, we could now be well beyond the wall of uh, uh, Marvel headquarters. You mean we're practically free? I believe so, Grubby. I think you're right, Gimmick. I can see light up there. You can? <laughs> then my theory was uh, uh, right. After you, Gimmick. Why, thank you, Grubby. Can you see anything yet? Not yet. Now do you see anything? Oh, yes. I uh, definitely see something uh, now. And I uh, definitely don't like what I uh, 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 see. Gimmick certainly is an extraordinary inventor. Even after the crash landing, this craft is still airworthy. Now we just need to rescue our friends. This? You say you and your friends can change yourselves into anything? That's right, Prince. That's why we're called anythings. Arusia, I have found the secret weapon that will get Grubby and Gimmick out of Marvel's evil grasp. So much for your pathetic escape attempt. Now, are you ready to tell us where the crystals are hidden? Nope, no way. Absolutely e e not. In that case, you have exhausted our patience and sealed your fate. Come, Sludge. It appears that Queller is a, a quite a upset with us. So what? Who's afraid of that big bully anyhow? <laughs> oh, I am. Come, Sludge. We have no further use for those two. Can't I go back and scare them just for the fun of it? Not now. We have need of you elsewhere. As for those miserable little twerps, tomorrow they can begin work in our yin mines. But what about the crystals? My hunch is the Iliop hit them on the airship before he fell into his doom. I want supplies stocked for the Eclipse and alert the crew to stand by to sail. Right away, your awfulness! My stomach is doing fur flips. I don't know whether I'm supposed to feel hungry or scared. Oh, at least you have a, a, a choice. As for myself, I'm afraid I just feel a, a scared, Grubby. Come on! Huh? Come on! Move it! Goodness! What's all the uh, uh, noise? I thought prisons were supposed to be quiet. Now get started! And I want this floor to sparkle! Mop, two, three, four, mop, two! Bless my uh, uh, soul! That prisoner looks exactly like a, a, a queen! Yeah, and the other one looks like LB. I wonder what those two uh, uh, scoundrels are doing here. Well, Tweeg always said he wanted to clean up. <laughs> okay, let's move it! You've still got the whole west wing to do! Shoulder mop! Now march two, three, four! March two, three, four! March two, three, four! <sighs> hey, Grubby, hey, are you all right? Oh, I was thinking about Teddy. Oh, I think about him too, eh, hey, Grubby. Quite eh, hey, often. I sure do miss him, Gimmick. I'd do anything if it would bring him back. I would, eh, too. But I'm afraid we'll have to settle for Teddy living on eh, in our eh, memories. That's it. This soup will make you feel better. How come we need all this cotton candy, Miss Leona? You'll see, Wooly, when we get to Marvo. 